Hey everyone, thanks for joining me on Silt for Good today. Why should you choose Grips at E60? Well, Grips at E60 is our water-based epoxy primer and barrier coating. And it's a unique coating, it's a, it's a water-based system, and epoxies have a very broad spectrum, and some people sort of tend to sort of package them up with what they see that could be out in the flooring areas with flooring epoxies or protective coating epoxies. But the Grip City E60 is a water-based epoxy that we use primarily for two functions. One, it's a vapor barrier primer for many of our membrane systems. And when I talk about a vapor barrier primer, it's used primarily on surfaces that might have some residual moisture or dampness. So concrete slab that could still be slightly damp, a screed, which is more commonly the case. And before you go and put a membrane out there, you want to ensure that the membrane doesn't blister or debond from the surface because of residual moisture trying to push it up. Ideally for external works, E60 is a fantastic primer to use on a screed or a slab that could be cured but might have had some rain on it and there's got a residual moisture content level in there and that you don't want your membrane to blister when the sun comes out. So being a water-based epoxy, it'll bond to a damp substrate. There's no hazardous odors with it. You mix up our part A and part B in an even uniform volume. It comes to a nice homogeneous consistency, easy to roll out or brush out. You get a nice coat over the floor and that will act as your vapor barrier primer. If you want to use this as a hydrostatic membrane, the Grips at E60 can be used in situations like a basement on walls or you've got even floors with rising damp and if you get rid of the efflorescence this product can be used and it's got very good negative hydrostatic pressure because it goes very hard and that allows you to use it in those situations which may not actually have a waterproof membrane applied on top but you're stopping any of that dampness or efflorescence coming through including those vapors and so commonly used in cellars but the other added bonus of Grips at E60 we have a potable water certificate with this product it actually can be used inside a water tank and it is safe to use for human drink water consumption and you'd use it in a water tank where you've got a structure that's got no joints or it might have a couple joints that can be taken care of with a fillet, not, a, not an elastic joint. But it's a hard wearing coating, can handle continuous immersion and it's safe if you've got water in there for human consumption. So we've had people that have even tinted it for situations like with fish ponds and water features etc. But the water tank application is there for you and one to consider. But the most important thing is that when you understand using it with our range, grip set E60, like I said before, with, the grip set, uh, with our grip set membranes, if you're putting on a screed or concrete slab, all of our liquid membrane range, our grip set 38, P39, the express range, can all go directly applied over the top of this product. If you've got a situation where you are putting a cementitious coating over the E60, in that uh, application there you need to ensure that you get it over there within 48 hours after the E60 has been applied otherwise it goes very hard and that will impact the adhesion of your cement based coating to the E60. With our liquid uh, elastomeric coatings there's no time issue but with cementitious that is the case and for those of you out there that might be putting a self leveling compound or some sort of cementitious adhesive over the top be aware of that. If that is the case and you get over it uh, and sorry, you have to get over the E60 after a longer period of time than 48 hours. Then the simple thing is give it a good clean down and you can give it a recoat and then get over it then and you find the adhesion will still bond. Any questions on this, come our way. We can help you with those answers and guide you along. It is what we call a specialist primer. However, for many of our customers around the country, particularly in the eastern states, using water-based epoxy is something they do every day. And the biggest advantage of Grips at E60, it's made here in Australia. It is the premium grade, but not at the premium price. Far more competitive than some of those brands that have been out there for many, many years that are sort of at the extreme levels of cost. You'd be very surprised on how cost effective the Grips at E60 is and affordable for you, giving an A1 job. <music>